Why shouldn't I kill you? To pay your family back for what it did to mine. I want to you say help revenge speak. against the Lannisters. I killed my mother. How do Joanna I know you Lannister, are who you say I was you born. are? I if only I were a Tywin Lannister. If you are. Bolton. I think it'd be fair to say, based on what you just said, that you don't write to a plan. The, the writing more just, you know, grabs you and, and you just sort of chase it. Uh, yes and no. I, I mean, I, I do know where I'm going. I, I uh, know where the story ends. I know the fate of the principal characters. No, I'm not going to tell any of you. <laughs> um, but there is a considerable amount that you discover in the process of writing. Um, that's the fun of writing, actually. Uh, I've talked about, uh, in, in many other interviews, about the two kinds of writers, the, the gardener and the architect. You know, the, the architect uh, is like an architect planning a building when he plans a novel. He, he knows how many stories it's going to be and how many windows it's going to have and how it's going to be heated and what the roof is made of and where the plugs are going to be in each wall and et cetera, et cetera. And he works all of that out and blueprints all of that or outlines it in the case of a novel before he drives the first nail or writes the first sentence. Um, the gardener digs a hole and throws in a seed and sort of waters it with his blood and hopes <laughs> that uh, something interesting comes out. Now, you know, mind you, the gardener knows certain things. The gardener knows whether he plant, planted a, a potato or a geranium. But, uh, and it would be very surprising if you plant a potato and a germanium comes up. But uh, a lot is discovered in the, in the process. I, I think all writers are some combination of these two, but they, they tend, according to your personality, to one side or another. And I'm much more on the gardener side. I am, you know, I think like 90% gardener. As were somebody like J.R.R. Tolkien, who, uh, you know, one of my literary idols who uh, started out writing Lord of the Rings as a sequel to The Hobbit and uh, it grew considerably. The tale grew in the telling, as he said, as mine has. She was eventually sold